Tears Through Fear, Who Is She? A sister, a mother, a daughter, a cousin, a friend, a lover. Growing up, I often wondered who she was. Then one day, out of the blue, she appeared and she was me. Open your hearts and your mind to what will be a journey. Although it was not easy, but it was well worth it. Let's converse, share, cry, acknowledge what our purpose in this lifetime is. Then ask yourself, tears through fear. Who is she? Hey guys, so today I would like to share with you a poem that I wrote back in 2014 called Identity. Now, I went through this phase, but that was in the early 90s. No, it was actually the 80s. Oh, I'm aging myself now, but you can see I'm aging myself. So was it an identity crisis? Was it for fashion? Was it just pure or fashionable thing to do at the time? So let's go through this poem. Let me know what you think. I used to be blonde with blue eyes. One look at me, you would be surprised. A black girl who should have been dread, but decided to go blonde instead. What was I going through? One would ask. Was I hiding or wearing a mask? Was I ashamed of my co community? Or was I disowning my identity? Owning this look as if it was my birthright. As I held on to my eyes and my hair so tight. This look I had to decide. Was I easily recognized? This masquerade sure won't last as I gradually unveiled the mask. I did not look the part. Suddenly, I cried out for help. My outer appearance was only layers of deceit. On refuse, refusing, on refusing to open up about my family history. A child born to a queen who looked just like me. For the first time, I felt free. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you are hiding behind the mask. Thank you for checking in Jen's Poetry Den. You have yourself. Actually, I also have Jen's Poetry Den. And this one is Jennifer's Journey to Wholeness. Thank you. Have a great day. And be blessed. <laughs>